Good morning from SeaWorld, guys. Hey, I forgot. I thought today was a Seven Seas Food Festival because I forgot my lanyard. I'm like, oh, crap. I'm going to have to buy a new one. But then I realized it's Thursday through Sunday is the food festival. If you're new to this channel, my name is Bill. I'm usually accompanied by my beautiful wife, Melissa, who's not here today because she had to work. We make content for, about Disney, Universal, SeaWorld, and stuff around the Orlando area. So if you like that, you know, give this video a like, subscribe to the channel. I, I greatly appreciate that. Anyways, with that being said, I'm gonna show you guys around SeaWorld. We're gonna try some different foods. And if you're a pass holder, you also get free beer too as well. So let's go in, enjoy ourselves, and have a blessed day today, guys. Such a nice day out today. Look at this beautiful lighthouse here. This is so nice, such a gorgeous day. Makes me wanna go swimming, it's so beautiful out. I showed this in a previous video, but when you're a pass holder, you get actually not one, but two free beers how cool is that that's awesome they offer that you get a lot of good deals here too at sea world like you'll get stuff where you can go feed the sea lions little fish and stuff like that there are certain every month they do something different so that's actually pretty cool that they actually offer that here that's awesome cheers guys yeah when i got up this morning i thought today was the um the Seven Seas Food Festival, and it wasn't. I'm like, oh no, I forgot my lanyard at home. That's okay, I'll just buy a, a, the $70 one and get stuff. But then my wife's like, do you really wanna waste some money? I'm like, well, I'm gonna have to, I'm already here. I'm not gonna go all the way back home now. So then after I get here, I realize on the sign, I'm like, I'm like, I'm such a dummy sometimes. I realize it was Thursday through Sunday is the food festival. We always come on Fridays and I'm here today on a Wednesday. There is no Seven Seas Food Festival today. It starts tomorrow. So I'm like, ah, geez. So I'm like, you know what? I'm just gonna stay here and I'll film some of the uh, food places that they have to offer here. All right, we're gonna head over to Mama's Pretzels. They have a pepperoni pretzel, a jumbo pretzel dog. They have cinnamon pretzels. I'm gonna try the pepperoni pretzel. That sounds unique. I'm definitely gonna try that. That's something different. So we're gonna head over there. Okay, I'm over here at Mama's Pretzels. This pepperoni pretzel right here looks really delicious. I'm gonna try that. That looks so good. And they have a jumbo salted pretzel too. That also looks good as well. But we're gonna go with the pepperoni pretzel. All right, guys, I just got the pepperoni pretzel pizza over here take a look at this this is what it looks like look at that oh my god i can't wait to bite into it and i got a rolling dirty craft beer it looks dirty all right let's give it a try i'm gonna try this first that is good i actually had a sample already they give you inside if you want like a, a little sample size before you order it they'll give you a little sample size so that's actually pretty cool now Let's give this pepperoni pretzel here a bite. Mmm, that is good. I wish they would have a little bit more sauce inside of it, because it's like, look inside, there's like really no, no sauce in it. I like a lot of sauce on my pizza, but other than that, it's pretty good. Let me take another bite uh, deeper into it and see if I can find any more sauce. Or just, or just a cheese and pepperoni on a pretzel. Yeah, it's just cheese and pepperoni, like on like a pretzel here, but it's good, delicious. And with the beer, makes it perfect. I love it. Right, that Mama's Pretzels, what I thought was pretty cool is when you go to go pay, you put your stuff on this scale here, and I guess it reads it all somehow, I don't know. And the guy came over, he scanned um, these QR codes underneath the thing, especially when you're a pass holder, you get a discount, and he scanned it, and all I do was pay. But that was pretty neat. I've never seen nothing like that before where you put your stuff on your stuff on a scale and it, I guess it reads it that way. That was pretty cool. Oh, and one other thing I want to let you guys know. Out here in the Florida sun, you gotta drink this fast or it gets warm quick. I just, that's a little tip here. I'm not telling you to down your beers, but take bigger, bigger drinks, not sips. I know I'm wearing a Finding Nemo shirt, but I think I'm representing SeaWorld too. It's sharks, fish, and so is SeaWorld, so hey, 
I still think I'm representing both. I always feel weird wearing something Disney here, but I'm like, hey, it's still fishing sharks, just like I just said, so nothing wrong with that. And I got the SeaWorld hat. This is the one I purchased from here that I like. It actually keeps me pretty cool too. I forgot to mention one thing. I was complaining that there's no sauce. I forgot, they have little sauces here you can get, like a marinara, a cheese sauce, a beer cheese sauce. I completely forgot all about that when I ordered this. But yeah, it would have. I should have got a marinara sauce to dip this into. It would have been just like a pizza. But hey, just letting you guys know that they definitely do have sauces here to dip your stuff in. I know on the sign that I showed you guys earlier, it says Pretzel Kitchen, but it's, uh, if you look at the name above it, it says Mama's Pretzel Kitchen. So here it is. If you have little ones, you got a whole Sesame Street land here. Take a look at this. I actually have a merry-go-round over here on this side. There's a merry-go-round there. Sunny day carousel. I love how this has the whole Sesame Street vibe. Cookie Monster right there. That is so cool. They have a little train over here too that you can ride and stuff like that. If you actually go around these buildings, they had a, a lot of interactive stuff. It says, do not knock on the can right here, but we're gonna knock on the can anyway. That's cool. Let's do it again. Hey, I'm trying to sleep here. Yeah. Oscar the Grouse is getting mad here. And then they also have a pretty cool splash pad here. If you want your kids to get wet, there you go. They cool off in this Florida heat here. Best time to come here is when the food festivals are going on because you've got a variety of options to choose from. If you come here with not, not, you know, no festival going on, you're limited to the food options that they have here. I mean, they got a lot of good food. They have straight in front of us Altitude Burger, but I'm gonna let you guys know right in advance that that place is not cheap. I think my daughter just got nuggets and a fries and a coke there. It cost like 20 something dollars for that. All right, guys, I decided to rent a paddle boat here. I'm on this little beautiful flamingo here. And we're just out in the water. And doing this is going to be a little bit difficult because I'm paddling by myself. So I'm going to try and just paddle slow and take my time. This place is so cool. I'm having so much fun out here doing this. And it was only... If you're a pass holder, it's only $5 to do this for like 20 minutes. But it's going to be tough to keep up paddling for 20 minutes because I'm out of shape. I just started working out actually again yesterday. But right now I'm not in the, the best of shape like I used to be. So I'm working on it. But this is so much fun. Look at this. So cool. Look at the view you have here. This is so cool. You got to stay within the limits. You can't get too close to the rocks or the bushes over here or across these buoys here but other than that just enjoy yourself this is fun my little pink flamingo here I gotta watch I'm over here looking at the camera I gotta watch the other boats too as well but that's so cool just to be out here and do it I'm like you know what at first I was like ah, I don't feel like paddling but then I said you know what I'm gonna paddle anyway so let's paddle away <laughs> this is fun if you want to go right run on here let me show you the steering here is if you push right you go right left you go left and then just pedaling with your feet pedaling with your feet is the rest of the stuff but yeah good exercise <laughs> seems like everybody's just following each other but you know me I gotta go outside of the rules I don't just follow people. What is gorgeous view though out over here? Look at this. So nice today. Wow. Such a great view. Look at the view of all the coasters and stuff over here as well. Wow. The thing I like about being out here is quiet. Yeah, you get 20 minutes out here five dollars if you're not a pass over holder for self for single riders it's uh seven dollars for it not bad yeah wow i love these gorgeous days we've been having it kind of stinks though because we haven't had no rain it's been kind of dry but it's also been beautiful out as well oh, the other people already went back in i don't even know what time i started on here 
but I just I just got out here. But yeah, seeing all these coasters from here, wow, such a great view. See Mako over there in the distance. You know, I've never rode that thing right there. I never rode that. What is coming down? It says SeaWorld on it. I have no idea what that is. I've never rode it. I guess you go up and you see like different like scenic views of stuff. Pretty cool. Yeah, the cast member that I ran into here, or team member, whatever they call her, she's a really nice girl. She wanted to know the name of our YouTube channel. She just started out with a channel. That's actually pretty cool. You know, I love talking to people. That's one thing I, lo I love about vlogging. You always meet new people. It's so much fun. Oh my God, I love it. I love it. I'm gonna show you guys some flamingos over here. Hey guys, I'm riding a bigger version of you. Hey guys. Hello, it's a big version of you guys over here. The key is when you're over here by yourself is to uh, just paddle slow. Take your time, there's no rush and stuff. When I was a kid and I used to ride these things, I used to be wanting to fly. I used to be hauling, at, hauling butt. I almost said the A word. This is a kid's channel. But yeah, I used to be flying on these, on these things. But right now I'm by myself. I'm just taking my time just enjoying it it's just it's so much fun you know relaxing it's peaceful i love it i'm having such a great time <laughs> i can't wait to see the look on my wife's face when i told her i actually rode these <laughs> my flamingo is lopsided i'm like leaning to one side because i'm in here by myself so all the weight is on my left side <laughs> over at the sea fire grill i got this tropical hurricane this drink looks friggin amazing it's uh uh bacardi rum banana liqueur pineapple you name it it's all in a guava looks delicious let's give it a try oh my god that is so good and refreshing on this hot day after doing all that paddling i definitely needed this this thing is delicious you don't even taste the alcohol in it it is good oh yeah and it's not pre-made she actually mixed it and made it Really delicious, guys. Today would have been a great day to ride the coasters. I'm over here watching Pipeline, which is a stand-up roller coaster. Kind of like a surfboard that you're on, but you're standing on it. When I saw that take off, I only saw like a couple people, only a couple people on it. And that was, that's weird. Cause usually every time I come here, it's always packed. This is like the perfect time to ride it. Cause there's like nobody on it. It hasn't even taken off yet. It's been a while since um, they've launched anybody on it. Wow, come during the week way easier to get on things here it goes now a few people just went on it look at that that is so much fun they actually have a mother's day brunch here on may 12th on a sunday that's actually pretty cool to see that says reserve your spot now all right guys i had a great day today even though it wasn't the seven seas the seafood festival but i still had a good time today i showed you some drinks i showed you some of the food that they have here to offer now tomorrow we'll be at magic kingdom but with that being said i love y'all we'll see y'all next video bye guys